Now, let's bring this right down to the oil company that Mike and I started in Belize Natural Energy. What does it mean to you guys here in Highlands Ranch in Denver and in Belize? And what are the solutions? Um, well, firstly, if you think, I'm going to use Belize as an example. If you think of the oranges that are all grown in Belize or the sugar cane or the bananas, Belize is quite famous for those fruits, but they shipped them out to mainly the UK at that time. Instead of, for instance, Belize making delicious orange marmalade, or instead of Minute Maid, May, Minute Maid making the orange juices in Florida, uh, they sent the raw materials away. Now, what, what I would like to do, and actually I'm going to send an article, it was in Forbes magazine, which is a business magazine, but it is about what I'm about to tell you, because I'd like your help. And I mean the help from students in Denver and the students in, in Belize. We have found a wax in the oil. Now we were bothered by it because it was blocking up the holes. We thought, what are we gonna do about this? But quite often necessity is the mother of invention. And remember that one because that's happening every day, you know. Like, how can I walk to school faster? Or can I find a shortcut and da, 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 you know, whatever it, it, it happens. We are creative, innovative beings. And um, sometimes the necessity just brings that right out of us because it's innate. But the paraffin wax that we have found in the oil in Belize is actually very similar to the wax called Vaseline petroleum jelly that most people in the world put on their baby's bottoms. Secondly, chapstick or lipstick is also a product from this wax. So what about, now I'll use a wheat farmer. A wheat farmer sells his field of wheat and gets the price of wheat. Or he makes flour and gets a slightly better price. Or he makes bread and gets an even better price. Or he makes sandwiches and gets an even better price and brings much more jobs to the area. Well, what we would like to do at BNE, yes, we're selling um, selling our oil and creating electricity, and yes, we're selling some of the natural gas and making cooking gas. But what about starting a cosmetic and a spa line in Belize, and linking maybe some of the Mayan uh, herbs with some of the uh, petroleum jelly and finding a way to have a natural spa product or cosmetic product line um, and I thought about I actually thought of a name Maya Mountain Magic but but I would love to get your ideas of what you guys think about what could be a really natural holistic spa line uh, or cosmetic line that would be used not only to make us pretty or make our hair gel, you know, whatever, there's all sorts of things, but that would carry with it the message of the importance of, let's just say, the magic in you. And that was one thing I wanted to remind myself of everybody. This book is the story of a little Belize boy called Mike Usher, and he really wanted to make a difference in his country. 